guess from who you guess right it's skims and I partnered with skims to show you guys different options that you can give people this holiday season so let me show you what's in the back first set I'm gonna put this on because I'm actually not wearing pants right now <laughs> this set fun fact secret I actually already wore it and it's so comfy oh this is so freaking cute I actually I have the throw over hoodie this is my first time putting on the zip up and this is so cute. It's so funny because before Skims reached out, I'd already bought this set in gray. It's cute. I want to wear this today. I look so cute. You guys already know Skims, their material, you guys, is so comfy and so cozy. I feel like it's worth the money, hence why I always buy it. I'm going to wear this today. It's, yeah, it's it's settled. But in regards to the holidays, I would give this to my aunt. And you know what's so funny? I actually wore this set with a pullover hoodie when I visited the Bay, and I just knew my aunt was gonna comment on it because she loves two-piece sets like this. And before she even finished her sentence, I said, Titi, I'm gonna get it for you for Christmas because I know her, you know? And just, she will love this, especially this color. I'm wearing a large on the bottoms, and I like the fact that you know, the band's pretty tight. It has a string so you can tighten it, but I just feel like it's, I feel like it's very comfortable. And then this is a medium. I did not want to take this off. This looks so cute, but we have more stuff to try on. Crap, I don't want to take this off. Next gift idea. <gasps> <sighs> Who doesn't like cute PJs? Now, I'm upset because I own these in the Sienna color. I have Onyx. I want to say I have them. I have so many Skims pajamas, it's not even funny. But I always get medium, and this time around I picked a large, and I like the large more. Like, yeah, it fits more loose, but it's just so. Let me move this other way. They, they want the outfit. It's so comfy. I like this size. Like, the band feels very. It feels perfectly snug. I like this size. I'm mad. I should have been getting large. It's just so cozy and cute. I want a wine glass. Ooh, I want to wear these tonight. <laughs> Who would I give these to? Myself. But also Monet, because Monet likes cute peaches too. Hmm. I feel like she would like these, and these are cute. I love the material. Super stretchy. Super stretchy. I love it, okay? But also, I don't know, it's like, it's like, just thick enough, you know, to wear like I'm not too hot, it's not too heavy. These are very comfortable. You know, if I want to wear it open, I could unbutton it too. Although I usually wear them closed because I just feel like it looks more, I don't know, put together. If you want to wear it open, I'd wear a white t-shirt underneath this because the stars are white, but you get the vibes, you know, very casual, very chill. Wait a second. This is so cute. Hold on, we have a guest. Ah! It's good. Ooh. Oh, look at these! Well, you pull up my hair, Noah. Say, look at me in my onesie. Say, I got skims. Say, they got skims for babies. Oh, we look so cute. You guys, this set, one, I think my butt looks really good in it. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, look at you, Papa. Oh my gosh, I love these. You guys, and look how soft. Oh wait, 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 <laughs> no. Look how soft, he's like guys, it's stretchy. Whoa, okay. Oh gosh, I love this. The material, look at it. Your material is so stretchy. And so comfy and so soft. It's so soft. These are so, they need to come out with more PJs in this material. Please, they need to, because this is too good. What do you think? I know I keep saying this, but I really don't want to take this off. It's way too cozy and way too soft. And I would gift it to myself. You know who liked these though? My mom would like these. 
these. These are totally her vibe. You guys, they have these little gift boxes with her underwear and bralettes. I just know these are gonna be comfortable because the material. Fun fact, maybe like 85% of my undies are from Skims. Like, they're my favorite underwear. I, I have them all right now, I have them all right now. Oh, but look at these. I truly can't pick a fave because I love this, but then I love the pajamas, but then I love the other pajamas, and I love the bralette and underwears. I don't have a favorite in this haul, but I do know that whatever you choose to gift your loved ones or even yourself, this holiday season you cannot go wrong with skims because their stuff is just such good quality it's so cozy but just so simple too it's not too much even the pajamas despite them having designs i still feel like they're just uh, it's just an easy gift to give anybody you know so i'm gonna link where you can go to shop everything i just showed you guys and more and some of the same things but a different color like i said i have this in gray and I encourage you guys to not go too crazy. Don't spend too much. Because man, I, when I tell you each time I each time I either get on the Skims website or if I happen to be in Nordstrom, I spend so much every single time. It's like hard not to get everything you see because everything is just so cute. So be careful, but be generous because it's the holiday season. So it's time to pick out some gifts. Even if it's for yourself. <laughs> Let me see you show your grill. Let me see you show your grill. Now, guys, free. Do, do. Do, do. 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 What you saying, huh? You know, no, you're, when you go up here and claim to be from Oakland, okay? I'm in LA. Stop it. Don't say that. Oh, no, no. That, it, you know, if you were like, why? No. In LA, are we, are we kind of the valley? Is he like a valley boy? He's a valley No. Yeah. No. Yeah. <laughs> See, I'm from the town. Oh, which part? Which part? They're gonna ask him. No, <laughs> hey, don't press him. <laughs> so, guys, and welcome back to a vlog. You guys, tell me why it's almost six and my other vlog isn't even up yet. And I kid you not, it's been at least two hours. No, and over two hours. Yeah, over two hours. Yeah, I'm exaggerating. Well, I'm I'm under exaggerating. I'm downplaying it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> And it's not even ready yet. Like, what the heck? So, yeah. Where are you going? So this is where we... Where are you going? Oh, yeah, we're going to put it in that corner. That's what I was thinking, too. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, this is You're so I mean, annoying. <laughs> I mean, crumbs sometimes. You have crumbs? Really? Yeah. We gotta do like Columbus Shore. Hold on, I'm trying to think. When he was in the swimming pool, da da dum. Walk it out. Walk it out. Oh, you wanna do walk it out? What are you? That's a walk it out. Look at our PJ, we're about to decorate the tree, the tree, we're about to decorate the tree, the tree, we're about to decorate, we're about to decorate, we're about to decorate, we're about to decorate, woo, 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 he uses laughs at this part, I mean risk my knees and everything y'all, I can't, I can't bend my knees the same way anymore, and that's absolutely necessary. <laughs>
stomp the yard. Why can't you help me? That was a style back then. He's wearing a pink in 2007. He was so fine. I'm so sorry. Girl. Like I'm so girl. sorry. I was just adding a little flavor. I'm so sorry. No, he was fine. They, they have to make a little more party. Oh, oh. Yeah. Ah! Wait, you never watched part of So cute. <laughs> Whoa. Good morning, guys. Yes. Oh my, is my camera shaky? I'm still in my PJs. Hold on, my lens is dirty. I can see that. I'm still in my PJs. I'm gonna shower after I clean. Because I have a lot of cleaning to do today. Starting off with Noah's room. I have to go through his clothes because he's a very big and fast growing baby and he can't fit a lot of his stuff. So I gotta take all the old stuff off no he can't fit that my nana <laughs> why can't he fit these things he's growing way too fast you guys he's five months and he's wearing six to nine and nine month clothes so yeah this three months stuff gotta go i was trying to make it spread <sighs> but they gotta go actually if you have a son and you need some clothes, let me know, DM me, and I'll ship some stuff out. He has a lot of nice clothes. But the response to my vlog is doing well. I'm mad because, you know, oh, remind me, I have to go to Spectrum today because they need to either upgrade my Wi Fi or something. Even though I selected the highest speed possible, allegedly, there's no way that's the highest speed. But it sucks, and so it took forever for my vlog to load, like I showed you guys yesterday. And then it's like, it took forever for the checks to run, and that's where YouTube... I can fit this. That's where YouTube sees if, like, you have any, like, copyright uh, music in your video. So it turns out I did. Oh, he can't fit this anymore. And so I'm not even getting paid for that video. And I'm mad, because it, according to YouTube Studio, it's performing better than usual. And I think it's because of my talk at the end of the vlog, which everyone seems to be leaving comments on, you know, thanking me for sharing that hypothetical experience. So, yeah, I'm happy I was able to express those feelings as well. You know, I've been trying to, I've been trying to help people the last few times I've, I've been vlogging, but I found myself oversharing and, um, yeah, I've, I've been threatened in regards to speaking about hypothetical experiences. So I, I was scared, but you know, at the same time, it's like, this is my life, this is my vlog, this is my channel, and if I wanna share hypothetical experiences in order to help people who are watching me, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that. I don't care if people try to use their status or their money in order to threaten me and scare me. That's bullying. And I'm not ready I'm not about to be, be bullied. He never got to wear this. Oh, man. Somebody has to take this. He never got to wear that. Dang, oh look at this shirt. My papa. He's too big for this. So yeah, I'm I'm happy that it was helpful to people. I got a comment where someone said that um they got triggered and had to click off. And I understand that because I, I have felt that just being on Twitter recently with a lot of stuff that's been going on. Move my camera. I have felt that 100%. You know, there's been a lot going on in the media that's been so triggering seeing because it reminds me of, you know, some of the things I've experienced. And yeah, I've had to like take breaks 
um, as to not get too triggered. The trip, because there's there's things that you think you're over until like you hear about other people going through it and you realize like, yo, this is kind of triggering. Do you guys hear how windy it is, by the way? It's very windy. Yeah, I couldn't sleep. It was awful. But P.S. Two things. One, like I said in my last video, I'm not dating, okay? That, look it, I made a little jokey joke. But here's the thing. My camera's shaky. I don't have, oh, I'll be honest with you guys, okay? Because, I mean, why not? In the past, I feel like where I went wrong was not necessarily, uh, I enjoy conversing with people. So, like, I, you know, I enjoy getting to know people. I really, I, I thoroughly enjoy having conversations with people. I think where I went wrong or where I've shot myself in the foot is becoming sexual with them too soon. Because then you start to exchange energies, then you become tied to them. And that's when things, uh, I, I feel like a lot of, I'll say people, use sex to manipulate. And so if they can get you to sleep with them fast enough, they typically will then use that to manipulate you. And I feel like a lot of times when we tie ourselves to people sexually, we end up staying in situations longer than we need to be, right? And so I think that's, I think that's where I went wrong and that's what I'm doing differently. Since Noah's father and I have broken up, I have not slept with anybody and it's been in a little bit it'll be six months which yeah, yeah that's not that long okay but you know have I had thoughts yes I'm human babes look it I'm not gonna hide my sexuality no more you guys already know I get down I got a child I can't hide that okay like you know although I do give innocent girl next door oh he can fit this um I'll be doing stuff you know <laughs> So, yeah, have I had thoughts? A hundred percent, absolutely, without a doubt. I feel like Noah can fit this. We can make this work one more time. I'm not throwing that away. My Nana. So, has it been, it, you know, actually, it really hasn't, it hasn't been challenging for me to not do anything. Because, I mean, I haven't really hung out with anybody. I've, I've been having conversations, but I haven't really spent quality time with anyone yet. Like, I haven't, I haven't done that yet. I don't know when I'll do it. I'm not in a rush to do it, but... I haven't put myself into the position to, you know, take it to a place in which I don't want to take it to. I'm not interested in sleeping with anybody right now. I'm not. I be thinking about it though. I be seeing some people like, oh, I just know it's big. <laughs> Guys, please don't judge me. I don't. I don't know if you peeped. I've been becoming more comfortable sharing more of my personality and my thoughts on my channel, and I need this to remain a safe space. Okay, because you know. I don't hide who I am anymore. I haven't been hiding, but you know, I'll um, I'll limit what I say. Damn, he can't fit this either. Okay, he can fit that. I'm about to say, damn, he can't fit nothing. Like what? What? Sorry, I don't realize he had so much stuff he can't fit. But now I'm seeing some people like, you know, old me, old me, would have. I don't know. I'm not gonna say what I would have done, but I would have did some. But you know, um, by the way, my hair is like not done. I didn't do it, so of course it's not gonna be done. Ignore the back, all right? I know it's probably a little bumpy for my my bonnet. He could fit this. Ah, oh, he could fit that. He could fit that. Okay. All right. I say that because I don't want you guys to think. Well, honestly, y'all can think whatever. I don't want to skip or how do you say? I don't want to go over anything. I want to go through it. And I think part of going through whatever I'm experiencing right now is not doing certain things I've done in the past. Which which means not sleeping with people, not getting excessively drunk in order to distract myself. That's something I've definitely done in the past. You guys have kind of seen me do it. Um, and so yeah, I've just been doing things differently. I think my issue is, can you fit this? No, can I fit this? I, I won't do things differently. And... It's like doing the same thing and expecting different results. Oh, he can't fit this. Is insanity. <laughs> so I don't know, babes. I might have been a little insane. But, um, yeah, no. I have not had the sex. He can't fit this. No, he can't fit this with anybody. And actually, I kind of enjoy it because I feel like whenever I've been sexually involved with people, it just, it just complicates things for me. You know, like I, I'm not in the space to, I'm not in the space to do that, not yet at least. 
so at least I'm able to recognize that and not do it and I think that's a big step for me but I, I do enjoy having conversations with people guys oh I'm still a lover girl at heart okay what do you want me to do how much do you want me to change no nah, they stop but like I I am you know like I love getting to know somebody I love when someone's getting to know me and they're asking me questions I'm just like wow you want to know me huh but see that's the thing though I've learned that I've learned to uh how do you say I pay attention to what, what what someone's asking me because I feel like in my previous situation looking back he didn't really ask me many meaningful questions at all he would ask me things that would help him determine if I would be of use to him I didn't see it that way at the time though I didn't see it for the red flag that it was he didn't ask personal things about me like who I am like where I come from like my upbringing like you know like who are you he would ask me things to try to determine if I would be easy to manipulate and control you know like tr trying to see where like what he needs to do in order to get me to conform almost but I didn't see it that way you know I think at the time because I was fresh out of a really bad relationship I just enjoyed the attention in general I'm not really moved by that. I mean, there's a lot of people who still give me attention now, and I don't really care for it. You know, if it's not meaningful, if it's not, um, I don't know, if I just get bad energy, I'm not ignoring the intuition anymore because ugh, I've got it. I've, I've had that intuition where I'm like, uh, you know, like, I don't really know. Like, something was off, and I ignored it. And you, you know what? That shit backfires on me every time. Every time I've ignored it. And so I'm like, all right, I can't afford to ignore that feeling anymore you know like oh this is off uh, I'm not really feeling this you know because I just, you know because I mean the reality is we, 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 we see stuff you know as it's happening but we'll choose to ignore certain stuff if it means well see that's the thing though that's the thing that's why I'm not having sex with anybody until I know for sure that my discernment is in a better place because I think that because I have moved quickly with people in the past by the time I did you know see things were off I was already sexually like involved with them so it was it was harder for me to break things off with them you know what I mean look I, I'm, I know I'm the only person who has experienced this so you can't judge me babe but yeah uh, that's why I'm like nah I'll wait look I'm not in a rush I'm not in a rush at all but we'll have more talks like the one the, or more i guess brands if you will like the one i inserted at the end of last week's vlog we'll, we'll talk about that later this week though you know i don't want to like uh overwhelm you guys with information so at some point this week we'll, we'll have more chats you know i have a lot to say this morning because <laughs> yeah i experienced something this morning that was just like oh gosh like you're just becoming a little bit too predictable for me like change your tricks I mean hypothetical me you're becoming too predictable for hypothetical me but I think that because that just happened I think that um it would be irresponsible to speak about it right now oh 3t oh 18 months 18 12, okay I'm just organizing them by month before I add more to it alrighty we got hella close to hang up we need to get our brows started, guys. But me's going first. I'm not 
Did you use uh, did it? Mm -hmm. We have here too. I use hair dye. I think I told you last time, remember? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Job seriously, morning. <laughs> <laughs> like, if you want, I can commentate. Yes. She's taking the thread. Oh, I was about to make a really bad joke. And sliding it across the brow. <laughs> this can't I'll go in there. <laughs> That's my guy. Thank you. And then? Yes, pretty girl. Thank you. Do you want an upper top? Mm -hmm. I don't want to hear this! <laughs> really? No, 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 I'm just asking. I get asked that a lot too. Even though like sometimes to be there, it's like, oh no, not today. <laughs> oh, they look so good. Okay, check the fit. She's got the I'm New Balance like, I'm sneakers. I'm dressed like my dad. Oh, <laughs> she's got the two-piece, gray sweat, skims, and she's got, where's the back from? Bodega. 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 <laughs> Same thing. And hair, inches, child. Yummy. Inches. Do you it's see? So oh my god. Trust Why me, when we get inside. Show them. That's my favorite hotel, you guys. I discovered it when I was. I can't zoom um, in. On the run. <laughs> <laughs> the SLS. You guys, I've stayed there so many freaking times. You guys know my story, my truth. Will the, the truth ever come out? I was about to say. <laughs> Yo, I could see us doing something so stupid. Like, like the Vogue. Um, how many questions they be asking them? 75? Ooh, you smell the food. We're oh. Here. Today we're here at Gyu Kaku. Gyu Kaku? Oh, shit. I'm so clumsy, dude. What? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Dates. You said you what? If I can't have a kiss around somebody I'm dating, they're not for me. Oh. 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 Hey. <laughs> We're waiting for we'll some get ups. Now we are waiting for someone to come help us. Oh, wait, wait. Who am I? Oh my gosh. I knew who you were when you picked them. <laughs> With my son. <laughs> <laughs> With the drill music in the background. I thought we were talking about the drill music. All right, we'll be back when we sit down. <laughs> we'll be back after these messages. Ah, uh, whatever goes around eventually comes back to you. So you gotta be careful, baby, and look both ways before you cross my mind. Just can't give 
Do something to him. What? I'm gonna turn up. Why did you tell me that? You told me to leave. No, Why no, no. I was ready to turn up on somebody. No. <laughs> like, talking to someone who really gets to know them is really hard because I want to flirt so bad, but I also, like, you know, yeah. I want to play it chill. I just got so many lines. What about you a, know? a minor flirt with each chill line that you throw in there? Look at him. I go hard or go home. I'm either gonna say something crazy or nothing at all. No, I just got home. Let's take a bath. You guys. He's so happy. I'll show you where I put Can everything you to. Your, Can you get your clothes? Look Can at that, clothes? Papa. Hi, oh, you're good. home. Are you washing so, this? You want to wash this? I probably will, yeah. It smells like his dad. <laughs> oh yeah, I didn't show you guys Noah's room. I cleaned it. Um, I put all his pants in here. Okay. And then extra onesies. Ooh. Perfect. I didn't even like fold them all because it Mom, just gets a mess. These are six months. He fits Good. six months. He oh fits my nine months. Gosh. And then bourbon cloths, bibs, hats, Perfect. and the extra products are up here. And then down there, and then his closet, everything's hung up too. Oh, okay. He's looking like, when what you recording? You're so cute. Hey. Say hi. Say hey. Say hi, mommy. Say hey. Say hi, mommy. I'm home. <laughs> Say, I'm home. Yeah, you're home. <laughs> I didn't even show them. I'm like, I did. I just want to do YouTube, right? I told you I do YouTube. Yes. Yeah. Yes. I didn't. I didn't show them his room. Guys, ignore the, those. Okay. I have to get those professionally hung. Right now, they're using. I'm using thumbtacks. But everything else is nice. Yes. And I'm getting wallpaper installed on this wall. Yeah. It's gonna be really yes. cute. You guys, as I, as I was saying, <laughs> hypothetically speaking, I'm not. Just so, some people, they just, the way they behave, it's just like, bro, you don't gotta be this way. You can just be cool. You don't gotta be angry. You don't gotta be passive aggressive. Why are you so mad? Hypothetically speaking, sometimes when um my friend's child's father goes to pick up their child, um when he's in the mood to like put up an act, he would pull up playing gospel music and you know acting all cool and just you know hi son the works but then when he's mad at her he pulls up playing drill music with a toothpick in his mouth off where my son you know but just this is just hypothetical and i'm just like all right big guy I'm get she should get out your way and it's just so <laughs> It's not funny. It's really not. It's really not. It's re none of this is funny. Cause like, bro, like, you got a child. Like, grow up. <laughs> it's just like, here's the reality. Don't have kids for the wrong reasons. You know, some people they want to have kids or want to get certain people pregnant because they want to control them and then get mad when they don't have that control. Don't try with somebody like me. That'll that'll work with me. Sorry. And that's the issue. It's like that now. <laughs> You have to be a father, babes. And you don't got control over me. What do you want me to do? You know what I mean? Like, I'm cool. Like, I'm not mean. Like, that's the least I can do. You know, but I'm not about to, I'm not about to let you control me. Because that should know. But I'm going to be nice to you. I'm going to be cordial with you. Like, you know, I'm going to be chill. Because that's my personality. But 
You mad because what? Your master plan didn't work? Maybe you should have planned it better. You know? Hypothetically. Yeah, anyways. I gotta work. Man on man. Get out of the kitchen! Wait a second. I'm so irritating. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sure I do. You guys, why is my turkey turkey? And this is like the second time I've ever made a turkey. Last year is the first time. I don't think I vlogged last year. But man, that, that's like looking like a bird, right? That looks pretty legit. I have the cheesecloth on it. But when I take it off, oh, Denzel said it looks fab. Oh my gosh. You know, the cheesecloth got burnt on this end, but you know, that's to be expected. I'm just mad though, because I don't have my injector. But it's okay. The turkey's still gonna turk, okay? You guys, in the shambles, because I kind of messed up on the yams. They were decent, but they weren't essentially pleasing, so I'm making new yams. The mac and cheese in the oven. I burnt my green beans by making corn. But we're about to take a shot. I don't have shot glasses. This is my friend Victor. Are you telling me single or are you like you no. chilling right now? Yeah, all right. <laughs> He's going to Hartford. I told him that. <laughs> this is so funny. I'm sorry. This shot will help. You want Jason? Oh. Oh, man. What you do like you need a Jason for? That's sweet. What you need a Jason for? I don't need a Jason. <laughs> Get y'all brain. There's some all wild cards in here. Got food. Let's see. B made everything. I told her I didn't want to cook. She made turkey. She made roast. Mashed potatoes. Corn. Yams. Gone. And some mac and cheese. Then we got some rolls. And she also made a pie. She also made sweet potato pie. I have a couple of those. Does that look better? I'm, I put my camera in different settings because I'm trying to get myself to like it because every few months as I'm vlogging, I'll start to hate my camera and want to change it. But girl, oh, my package came in the mail. Oh gosh, hold on, quick haul. He's cute, right? <laughs> no, that's not him. He's really cute, right? He's very uh, like handsome, I feel like. You know, there's this one photo I'm looking at and it, and it reminds me of Melvin. <laughs> Melvin, you're irritating, send it to me. I'm unboxing my packages. I guess it's so much skincare, it's overwhelming. Cast away. <laughs> you need some skincare? Because I have too much of it, it's stressing me out. <laughs> Like, I just, I don't know how I'm supposed to do all this. The second one was just to show how cute that was, whatever you call Oh, Papa. Oh, he looks so good in that pig. I'm sorry. Damn. He does. The real quick, it just gave me Melvin real quick. This is Peter Melvin. Like, the, the little- Melvin. Like you guys, I've never dated someone. I'm vlogging, by the way. I've literally never dated anybody named Melvin. Me and my friends have code names. I don't know. Why did you start calling him Melvin? That's a really good question because I cannot remember so many. We, we we were drunk when you came up with that. I think we had to be. Everyone gets a code name. You know, actually, I don't have a code name for him yet. That's how you know. There's yeah. hey, you, you guys want to know one of my code names for somebody? Ha! <laughs> Lotso. Yeah, from Toy Story Three. <laughs> it's so catchy. I just love that name. Big Lotso. Shut up! Not big, Lotso. Never was the little one, yeah. P.S. I um I got these dresses from Opali because they were doing a sale where you get three dresses for ninety dollars. I don't feel like trying this on though. I literally just got back home. I went to Spectrum. I went to that store, ah! and he told me I should call tech support. Yeah, or whatever they're called, because I guess. 
I don't know. He broke it down. You guys don't want to see how that's scoring. But then after the fact, I went to Dave's Hot Chicken and now I'm full. You stuck. You just got Dave out there now. In San Leandro, Kendall. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've never had it. I, I need to. It's literally right there. It's so good. Shit. I feel but so bad. Are, is all this plastic <laughs> sound? Is it annoying? Oh, the, the plastic. Is it annoying? No. Oh, okay. I don't have it. You guys were hot. Hey, you wanna know something funny? Hmm. The reason why I get scared to make hella sound while I'm on the phone is because my mom hates it. And if oh, I'm on the phone with her, her hates it. she'll literally be like, okay, bye. Like she wanna like, get the phone with me. I'm like, oh my god, I'm sorry. Yeah. So now I'm scared to make too much noise. <laughs> my mom hates when I do that. She hates when I call her and I'm eating. She's like, okay, did you call me to chew? And I'm like, oh, okay. Little mean <laughs> self. No, my mom is not mean. She's just a Virgo. Oh, this is cute. Oh, wow. Well, Paris Hilton just had another baby. I didn't know she had the first one. She has kids? <laughs> what? I think everyone does. <laughs> you, know my you know what's so crazy about him? Literally every single one of my friends that I showed him to in the beginning, they're like, oh, that's not your type. Everyone said it. Like, it never, the, the thing though with you, you very, it's very like roll the dice sometimes. So, which is not a bad thing. It's like, you know, I'm like, I'll, I'll give it a chance. I'm open-minded. <laughs> yeah. Which is not a bad thing, it's actually a really good thing. So, I never really, you know, it's like I know what your type is if you had to point one out, right? But it's well, I feel like the guy just showed you that's my type. Yeah, because, you know, this is your type more than the other one that you sent. Lotto? But it's, no, the, it's oh. still recording. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, okay, I know who you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> wait, 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 you're talking about Jim? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, th you think he's more my type in the gym? No, um, yeah, I do actually. But I'm not, yeah. saying that this, I'm not saying him is not your type. I'm just saying he gives more, like, it's a little quirky thing, you know? Like, mm -hmm. he likes stuff like, he likes stuff like a little, a little jab or like a little, you know, a different. A little a different something. Look. Yeah, exactly. No, I'm trying these on. I'm literally so full. Like, I'll do it later. Oh, all right, that was fun. I had to unbox these dresses I got. Oh, look at my trash. Ugh. Have you seen a Christmas Carol with Jim Carrey? Have I seen what? A Christmas Carol with Jim Carrey. No. Like the animated movie. Oh. Or do I sound really bad? <laughs> this is my song. Oh, I miss my bird. Stay open, gate. What are you doing? You saw me coming out. Raise your hand if you've been very inconsistent with your vlogging this week. Anyways, guys, we have a brow poem today. So, let's go. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. Always keep it super thousand wishes. Always down to run a mile. Don't shine, don't shine. 
skip no oxygen in the team Girl, by your side Baby, I'm down for you I'm down for you Say, baby, I'm down for you I'm down for you Never the sun, don't be shy on my side Keep no oxygen in the team Girl, by your side Baby, I'm down for you Down for you I'm down for you Down for you Down for you Down for you Roll and rock and get the vibe with you Ain't nobody get the fight with you Ain't nobody get the fight with you And none of nigga can't nobody get you Wild nigga from the wild side DC nigga so I'm real dry Yeah, yeah, got the wild time From the east side to the west side Super fake with the horse down Count money with the cross down Cheese down from my pants Leg, 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 leg with the score down Skirt, skirt in the coupe huh? As I shot it with a door huh? I ain't really been to fall in love With a husband, but it's yours I will be right Like the shoulder, baby And with the way that gets colder I'm right, yeah Said you should know that I'm right, yeah Oh, yeah. I will be right like you show your day And when the way that gets colder Know that I'm right, yeah Said you should know that I'm right, yeah, 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 yeah. Said you should know that I'm right, yeah, 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 yeah. Said you should know that I'm right, yeah, 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 yeah. Said you should know that I'm right, yeah, 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 yeah to get a bib. What's up guys? My brows look so dark right now. They're gonna be way louder than this when they heal though, so ignore that. But I've been home for hours, no one I took a nap, and now I'm waiting for my Instacart order to start cook some dinner. I'm gonna make a pasta inspired by this one dish I get at Bossa Nova. So I'm excited because I'm really hungry. And then at nine, which is in like an hour and a half, I have to go pick up Monet from her friend's house. Wait, our friend's house. She's at Brittany's house. But yeah, I have to pick her up at nine. 